Hey everyone, Barry Duff here. But let's do another exciting video of Phantomophobia. <laughs> or am I? Nah, just kidding. We're gonna be playing Minecraft. <laughs> or am I? Ha! Wrong again. We're gonna be playing Phantomophobia, but in Minecraft. That's right. You heard me right. A group of creators. Oh, here we go. Yeah, these group of creators made al almost an exact copy of Phantomophobia, that amazing trending indie horror game in Minecraft. Wow, I gotta tell you, the possibilities for Minecraft are just endless. Even the lobby room looks the same. I'm really impressed. So, let's. Get right into it. I played both of them. I played the original. I'm terrible at it. I don't know why. I always seem to get killed by the monster. So let's see if I'm equally terrible in this game. So how do I start? I got a few notebooks here getting started. Phantomophobia. Warning. This map contains flashing lights, jump scares, loud noises, and somewhat disturbing ghost textures. Ooh. If you're prone to any of these or have a medical condition, please avoid playing. I have a medical condition, but I'm going to keep playing. Well, let's get right into it. I don't want to read all that. That's boring. I played the original. So, oh, select contract, add item. Let's jump right into it. So we need to select the Oh, <gasps> Are these the items? Oh, crucifix, flashlight, the sanity pills, ghost books. That's awesome. <gasps> oh, that's cute. Anyway, let's select the contract. <gasps> Whoa, that's awesome. So, all oh, there's the jail. Looks like they're gonna be building more maps. I don't remember a pirate boat. Is there a pirate boat in the original? I think that's new. So, it said pick the contract Tanglewood Amateur, Grafton Intermediate, and Edgefield Professional. Well, I'm really bad at phantomophobia, so let's do professional. Done. Edge field. Street house. As opposed to, I don't know, highway house or Welcome something? Welcome to the quiet neighborhood of Edgefield. Don't get comfortable. There are reports of paranormal activity inside. Check your mission objectives and get to work. Oh, I'm gonna get very comfortable. Oh, ooh. It's got a map. That's awesome! Oh, it's got a basement. Don't tell me at the basement. Okay. So it looks pretty familiar. I remember the garage. Okay, so let's grab a flashlight. Are they strong flashlight? It looks like they're all the same flashlight. Items? The mama meter and EMF reader are the two most useful items. You know what? No, 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 no. Hold on a second. We need to communicate with the spirit. A spear box and the thermometer. We can do it. All right. Hey, Mr. Ghosty. I'm here to investigate. Find out what this guy's name is. Does he have a name? Richard Wolf. Wow, that's a badass name. Who are you? Well, if, why would I ask him that? His name is Richard Wolf. Kind of redundant. So, where is this guy hiding? We're probably gonna have to use the temperature. Mr. Ghosty, where are you? Come on, I won't bite. Alright. Come on, I promise. It'll be all cool. Let's be good friends. Please don't kill me. I know this is professional. I know you're very spiteful. But I just want to know your type of ghost you are. That's all it is. Ugh, I hate the basement. Hmm, so it appears not to be on the first floor. Let's try the second floor. Hey, Richard Wolf. Did you hear? Any relation to, I don't know, an actual wolf? I don't see anything here. Let's turn on the light. <gasps> He's here. He's in the bathroom with awful paintings. Are you in a unicycle? Anyway, focus, focus. Beer box. Uh, how do I talk? Do you miss being alive? Nothing detected. Suspicious, suspicious. Ooh, have you killed anyone? Hmm. I think this is a smart criminal ghost. Let's try it one more time. 
Are you old? You won't talk to me. You must be really shy. Or incredibly smart. Okay, so we got... Oh wait, that's right. We got our first evidence. Freezing temperatures. So let's grab another tool and let's see what we can find out. I think we need to get three clues to really determine what kind of ghost it is. So let's grab the book. And, oh, let's try an EMF reader. No, I just realized. Rich, uh, the nickname for Richard is Dick. So this guy is Dick Wolf. Did he make Law and Order? Whatever. Dick Wolf, are you here? Hello? Wait, I don't want my turning off that light. Oh, he's here. Oh, he's here. Dick Wolf, you here? Hello? I'm gonna turn this back on. Okay, the EMF reader. <gasps> no, no, no! Why? Why? Where? 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 Oh, here! Oh my gosh, it's a Grim Reaper! Go, 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 go! Oh no, the exit block! What do I do? I, I don't. I, can I throw this thing at him? You can have it! Please don't hurt me! Is this a dead end? I'm in a dead end! No, 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 no! One, 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 one! He can't go through doors! I, no, they can! What am I thinking? He absolutely can go through the doors. The guy escaped. Hello? Stop, 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 please. Leave the lights alone. He's near, but not too near. Hello? Oh, 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 oh. You keep flickering. Okay, go, 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 go. Wait, what do, what do I do? Can I juke him? Duke him? Dodge him? <gasps> he stopped. Yeah, that's right. I'm not so tough now, are you? Totally cut my cool. Wasn't afraid at all. This guy's nothing. So, let's see here. UV lamp and camera. So far, we only got freezing temperature, and we know he's Grim Reaper. Dick Wolf the Grim Reaper. Okay, cool. How's this one? Does it have any? Oh! It's got fingerprints. So that's fingerprints. We got two items, two evidence. We need one more. <gasps> he will! Where is this? Oh, that's a nice reference. I like it. So, looks like I got all three. Um, uh, ghost items. That's right. How do you work the camera? That's cool. I whoa, the lens is trippy. Huh? Rude. I wasn't done with the room. Wait, so that means I got three, right? Does that mean the ghost must be not possible? So it's not right? I didn't even do it right? But I got freezing temperatures. Ghost writings and fingerprints. So I guess freezing temperature is not the right one. All right, ghost orb. Let's check it out. Oh man, I forgot. I need to get out. I have to turn off the light in order to see the ghost orb. Dang it, I have to go back in. I could have been safe in the van. No, totally forgot to turn off the light. I just had to prove that he was wrong. One more time. Where are you? I don't think he communicates. I don't think uh, the Grim Reaper have both poise. Is that logical? I think that's logical. Maybe this light, what? Is he here? Is that him? I can barely see. Where's the light switch? Yeah, oh, he's right here. Ah, you're a little slow. Wait, wait, wait. Can I communicate? What room are you in? <laughs> He's not so scary. Not so bad. I can handle this. 
Any ghost orbs? Nope. Hmm. So what evidence do I have? Did I do EMF 5 enough? Gotta be the EMF. I don't even know what kind of ghost the Grim Reaper is. Three? Three? I need to get to five in order for it to count. What? That can't be it. Yes, got it. Yeah, my fox. It's a revenant. But oh, he's hunting. He's hunting. You the pneumonia. You the hammer. Ah! No, wait, no. Oh my gosh, this is a dead end, isn't it? I think I kicked his ass with the hammer. I think I, I beat him. What? Cool. So, I think we got it. It's a revenant. Oh, please tell me I got it right. Please tell me I got it right. Good job, team. Oh, I got it. Yeah. <laughs> I reached level two. Wait, I failed objective two? What was objective two? I don't see any objective. Well, let's try the next map. Tanglewood. Professional mode. Street house. Okay, so there's the power box in the basement. Of course it's in the basement. I think I remember this uh, map in Phantomophobia. So, uh, the one noticed difference I don't see is strong flashlight versus weak flashlight. Then again, I don't have any money, so I don't think I bought it yet. Okay, we always take the uh, thermometer, spirit box as well. I always take these two because they're the most useful items to me at least. Is this it? Wow, that garage door is echo reflective. Go in. Hey there, Mr. Ghosty. Who is this? Dylan Dunn. How you, uh, oh wait, he. Anything we can do to help? Of course not. So far, nothing. Dylan, you here? Well, you just square freak. Maybe Dylan is round, and he just doesn't want anybody to know. Oh, dang, that's a massive TV for this room. What is that, 150 inches? I don't notice any temperature drop just yet. Oh man, please don't tell me it's the basement. I hate the basement. Oh, don't be the basement. Is everything okay? Please don't be cold. Please don't be cold. Please stay warm. Stay warm. Central heating and air. Good. Not the basement. So, must be the garage. Are these candles lit? They didn't illuminate. They're dark. I've never seen dark fire. That's interesting. Is it in the uh, washer and dryer? The garage? Going to... Oh, he's here. Going to ride, eh? So we're dealing with the heavy biker. Spirit box time. Where are you? Here. Here. <gasps> he spoke. Uh... Have you killed anyone? Probably a good question. Wait, no! I'm gonna take that no reply at the heckin' yes! He killed everyone! Did it go? Haha, <laughs> act still and done if he's a girl. Hmm. Okay, how do I do this? I want a button to type. Can you show yourself? Aw, oh, man. What, what, what? No, it's flickering. He's here. Oh, it's a little. Oh my gosh, it's a girl. It's definitely a girl. Wait, is it? Oh, 
You should destroy that door. Ooh, what are you, what are you, please don't stab me. Dylan, I'm sorry I called you a girl. Okay, I thought you were, oh, I don't want, oh, okay, wait, the, um, I'm, I'm, where were I? I don't, I don't, I'm trapped. Yep, I'm gonna die. I'm still gonna die. Why did I pick professional? Man, I suck at phasmophobia. I can't even play the original game. I can't even play the spoof of the original game. To be fair, it is professional. Maybe I did overestimate my ability. Be next time. Let's try the third and final contract. Grapped in in professional mode. Farmhouse. Ooh. Welcome to the Grafton family farmhouse. There's something ominous in the air, so I highly recommend you get what you need and get out quickly. Grab your gear and get to work. Let's go with the trusty old spirit box and EMF reader this time. See what we can get in this creepy farmhouse. Ooh, looks big. Oh, got a light switch somewhere? Ah, here we go. And, oh. This is another birthday cake here. With dark candles. Actually, I don't think these are birthday cakes. These are death day cakes. Oh, I, oh. Ugh. Those are some creepy scarecrows. I'd rather have the clothes than that. Anyway, well, happy death day, Mr. Ghost. Where are you? All right. I need to use the MF reader. Actually, what am I doing? I'm being amateurish here. Always use the thermometer to determine a freezing room. I feel like that's the fastest way to be able to tell where they are. So let's swap that real quick and get going. Oh! I think this is it. Is it? It's right next to the death day cake. I was not expecting that. Okay, so we need to talk, but we can only do it in the dark. Should we leave? We mean nothing detected. Maybe closer to the cake. Can you show yourself? Nothing. Oh, come on. Talk to me. Is there a ghost here? Nothing. Okay, we got a shy ghost here. We got freezing temperatures. Let's go ahead and put that in. Let's grab another tool. That was kind of lucky to find the room so quickly to the entrance. Clark, you here? We'll put the camera here. That's a good angle. So far, there's been no activity. So, he must be really shy. Or I didn't find the right room. But we'll find out. Oh, that's right, there's no doors. So how am I going to determine whether if there's fingerprints? Let's try the ghost writing book here. Wait, what? That's it! That must be the location. Is he here? But no fingerprints. Let's check the camera and see if we can find a ghost orb. There it is! Ghost orb! Ghost orb! Yes! So we got it. Ghost orb and freezing temperatures. So what's left? Maybe we should try the spirit box again. I kind of want to know what this ghost looks like. I'm more curious what they look like than actually trying to figure out the clue. <gasps> he wrote in the book! Any last words? Plenty! I'm like, let me open a dictionary. I have every single word. Let's see here. Evidence? Ghost writing. So it's a URA. I kind of want to know what this one looks like. So how do I get the URA to show up? Oh, we'll anger it. Can you show yourself? Ah, uh, come on. I know. We'll turn off the light. Ah, uh, here we go. Oh, we'll see if he can show up. 
Do you like this house? Alright, clearly he's not gonna speak. Maybe that's the monster all along. It was just stand in the field. I'm trying to get this ghost to show itself. Is it actually ghosting me? Well, that's just rude. He thinks I'm not worthy to be killed. Oh, come on. I'm, I'll show him I'm worthy. I'm being weird. Oh, oh, Mr. Claw. Dang, it's a watermelon. Uh, I'm sorry. It's a shy guy. Hey. Cool looking. What happens if I touch it? Nothing happens. Uh oh. Hey, what? Oh, oh, that's the angry face. I didn't know you had an angry face. Oh, I'm trapped. Oh, run, run, run. I didn't know you had an angry face. Could, do you hide in here? Right? Is he gone? So they can't go through the door! <laughs> I got killed, Mr. Pumpkinhead. Great work. You completed your objectives. I got it right. It was a year, eh? Cool. I really enjoyed this game. I'm, like, quite impressed. Like, all these items were on point they really do mirror the original game yeah there were a few things you couldn't do here but you can do in the original such as you know take pictures uh have a lighter they could use a torch but i think they were trying to simplify it just enough for minecraft to be working i also was really excited to see all the type of different ghost textures in here in minecraft it was really, really fun. I did play all three maps. They are going to make more, I think, according to the map I saw. There was the prison and a pirate ship. I don't remember that in the original, but I think they were trying to add their own signature flair. I'm kind of curious about that one. That one looks a lot of fun. I gotta say, to the creators who made this mod pack, nicely done. I'm quite impressed. And also to all those people who played this mod pack before, let me know what your experience has been like. I want to know what you guys think about it. Well, that's all I have for this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Hope you have a good one.